Celtics. As they always do, find a way to win down the stretch at home. 117 to 114. Larry Bird scored 37 points, 9 rebounds, and 9 assists. The Pistons had lost to the Celtics in seven games in the 1987 Eastern Conference Finals. And in Detroit's locker room afterwards, the questions were about the superstar who dominated them again. And then things got complicated. It starts because an unsophisticated Dennis Rodman is asked about Larry Bird. And let's be real. It's probably the first time in Dennis Rodman's life that a white guy tuned him up on the basketball court. Dennis Rodman just went to Larry Bird University. Larry Bird was the god in the NBA. You know, he's like the, the great white hope. And I said, if Larry Bird was a black guy, he was, he'd just be a regular old, regular old basketball player. And I didn't realize what I said, you know. And someone ran over with that comment and asked Isaiah Thomas, your teammate, said something, do you agree with it? A very, very good basketball player. I think he's an exceptional talent, but I'd have to agree with Rodman. If he was black, he'd be just another good guy. <laughs> Isaiah, who clearly had the sophistication, picked the wrong white guy to make his point because larry was the baddest boy on the planet if he was black he'd be just another good guy <laughs> all hell broke loose after that and, and all the ire was focused on Isaiah. that turned into reverse racism race every everybody jumped on that following larry's statements he's gonna take off he's got the game tonight and isaiah will stay for questions it got so controversial that Bird and Isaiah held a press conference during the finals between the Celtics and the Lakers to try to clear the air. You know, just walking in this room and seeing everybody, it must have touched a lot of people. And, um, and that's why we're here. We're trying to cover up for each other. I think all of you who know me, who has ever interviewed me before, know that I joke and kid a lot. So if you can... was a chance to be a statesman. There was a chance to do the right thing or the wrong thing. Isaiah took course B. We, we lost the game. I got accused of being a racist, and I'm I'm, I'm, I'm bad guy now. <laughs> Isaiah trying to start digging himself out of the hole. I even looked up the word racist. Do you know the definition of that word? All he was trying to do at that point was get away from this as quickly as possible. And in his retreat, it got more confusing and more people piled on him. And it just turned into one really big mess. Isaiah, tell, tell me about the laugh. Now, is that a sarcastic laugh or is that a laugh of someone who's saying, you know exactly what I mean? No, it's a very sarcastic laugh. I think anybody who knows me well. Do you regret the comment? I never made the comment. Uh, I regret not being um, smart enough to never repeat someone else's quote. The comment's effect on Isaiah and his image was undeniable. But for the team, the impact was totally different. That was a turning point. Isaiah really came to my rescue. That right there was a telling moment for me and for the team that we'll do anything for each other. And 